The Dasso Rafale, a more military meaning means gust of wind, and burst of fire, is a French twin-engine, canard delta-wing, multi-role fighter aircraft designed and built by Dassault Aviation. To reduce development costs and increase prospective sales, France entered into agreements with Britain, Germany, Italy and Spain to produce the agile multi-purpose fighter, the Eurofighter Typhoon. The ensuing disagreements over the division of labor and differences in requirements led France to implement its own building program. Originally planned to enter service in 1996, the Rafale experienced significant delays due to post-Cold War budget cuts and changing priorities. The aircraft is available in three main variants, the single-seat land version of the Rafale C, the two-seat land version of the Rafale B, and the single-seat carrier-based Rafale M version. Introduced in 2001, the Rafale is produced for the French Air Force and for carrier-based operations in the French Navy. Rafales have been used in combat in Afghanistan, Libya, Mali, Iraq, and Syria. Several upgrades to the Rafale's weapons and avionics are planned to be introduced in 2018. In December 2000, French Naval Aviation, Aeronaval, the Air Force of the French Navy, received its first two Rafale M fighters. On 18 May the following year, the 12th Flotilla Squadron, which had previously operated the F-8 Crusader, became the first squadron to operate Rafales after being officially reactivated ahead of delivery of the 6th Rafale. Flotilla 12F immediately followed the Trident doorship by boarding the Charles de Gaulle aircraft carrier with warships from 10 other countries. During maritime exercises, the Navy tested Rafale avionics during simulated interceptions with various foreign aircraft, in addition to carrier takeoffs and landings. After nearly four years of training, the Rafale M was declared operational with the French Navy in June 2004. The Rafale M is fully compatible with U.S. Navy aircraft carriers and several French Navy pilots have been qualified to fly the aircraft from U.S. Navy flight decks. On June 4, 2010, during a training exercise on the USS Harry S. Truman, the French Rafale became the first fighter jet of a foreign navy to have its engine replaced on an American carrier. In 2002, Rafales were first deployed to a combat zone. Seven Rafale M departed with Charles de Gaulle of the French Navy during Mission Heracles, France's participation in Operation Enduring Freedom. They flew from carriers in Afghanistan, but F-1 standards precluded air-to-ground missions and the Rafales saw no action. In June 2002, while Charles de Gaulle was in the Arabian Sea, the Rafale made several patrols near the India-Pakistan border. In December 2015, American and French military officials reportedly discussed the possibility of the French Navy's Rafale M's flying combat missions from the U.S. Navy's Nimitz-class carriers as soon as January 2017. This will allow the French Navy to continue operations against ISIS while Charles de Gaulle is carrying out combat operations. The major refit, which will take a year and a half, is scheduled to begin in early 2017. Although Rafales have launched and landed on U.S. aircraft carriers to demonstrate interoperability, this will be the first time they will fly combat missions from one. A total of 18 Rafale M can be deployed on a single carrier, although some space must be provided for French Navy support crews accustomed to maintaining the Rafales, as well as for spare parts and ammunition. Operation Chesapeake, conducted in May 2018, when 12 Rafales with nearly 350 support personnel boarded the USS George H.W. Bush for two weeks of carrier training after conducting a month of shore-based training at Naval Air Station Oceana.